Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I am here in the F-18 Hornet Sea, and um, this is the low altitude reconnaissance mission that comes with the Normandy map for the Hornet. It is the only mission that they give you for the Hornet. Uh, this is a pretty tough one because you really got to stay super low and uh, avoid all the air defenses. It says I'm loaded with two harms, but I've never learned how to use the harm, so I'm not going to worry about that. Um, and it says, you know, the rolling hills with forests can make you near immune to SAMs if you keep low and fast. Well, I've been keeping low and fast, but the problem is I ended up running into a, uh, what is ZSU, which is an anti-aircraft gun, that pegged me pretty hard and uh, made me handle very very t tough because it made it very unstable at 700 knots almost and i ended up wrecking after i took a shot so that didn't work out so well so let me get some things ready here turn on that guy waypoints sequence auto and not that I'm going to need it. I'm not going to shoot anything, but I'll just turn the master arm on. Oh, wait, dispenser too. Let's turn that guy on. Okay, I think that's all I'm going to need. Let's go see what we can do. I made it to waypoint three, and that's the best I've done so far. Uh, if it wasn't for that damn anti-aircraft gun, I think I would have done pretty good. Okay, flaps back to auto. And let's get over to that first waypoint. And get our ass as low as possible. They said under a thousand feet. I was kind of cruising along at like 90 to 300 feet. And that seemed to quiet the uh, warnings. Yeah, yeah. And that is the danger of trying to fly under 100 feet because it just doesn't work out that well. The terrain changes too quickly and you don't have enough space to correct. You almost don't have time to look down at anything. I did rather well, but the problem was sticking to the waypoint between 2 and 3, there was a uh, SAM site, not a SAM site, a uh, tripway that uh, pelted me and then just completely screwed up my stability, and I had to make a little bit of a turn, and I was fighting it for a while, but um, ended up taking me out. I crashed. I guess it can have credit for killing me. This is the hard part. See how it says 140 feet, but look, everything else is actually higher than that. So these tree lines are pretty tough. But if I stay below this, these guys don't fuck with me, which is good. And I had labels turned off, so I tried to do it like the big boy. Wasn't a good idea, because that thing pegged me and pelted me hard because I literally went right over top of it and I didn't see it coming. Okay, I made it to the first waypoint. Let's see if we can make it to the second waypoint. I'm just a little bit off here. Trying to stay to the right of these guys so nobody can take a shot at me like they did before, because that was ugly. I'm not a fan of that. It wasn't very nice. Especially, I was literally almost at 700 knots. I was like 697. And then I had to make a little bit of a tight turn, and I just could not control it. Too much damage to the uh, airframe. I didn't have time. When you're going this low to the ground, you don't have time to switch to the external view and see what kind of damage you got going on there. Come on. Yeah. 
Yeah, I think it's this guy up here in red, this little red dot up ahead that I didn't see last time because I turned off labels because I tried to be a big boy. Because everybody bitches, oh, be a real pilot, turn off the labels. Well, I don't see shit that way. Yeah, I'm going to go to the right of him a little bit. I don't want him pelting me again because he did a pretty good job of it last time. Whoa. Okay, I made it to that one. Now this guy, I want to stay away from him so he doesn't pelt me. Yeah, he's real close to the waypoint line right there. And I don't want to mess with him. <clears throat> Ooh, close, close, close. Oh, yeah, I got to go right between two of them right here. Oh, there's another one right there, too. Come on. I feel like I'm going to pop over this hillside and he's going to be right there and pelt me. Isn't this thing supposed to get some kind of ground radar? I think that would really come in handy. I feel like that guy's going to be a little too close too. So I want to go to the edge here and just pull out of his way. Okay, where does that waypoint go? The next one. Man, I'm high, 830. I don't want to be that high. But it seems like the terrain level has moved up. And I'm just keeping to the treetops here. Whoa, that was close. I really felt like I was going to hit that treetop. Come on. Should have a left turn coming up soon. Should be getting me to the next waypoint. Come on. Whoa. This is tense, guys. Nice. Okay. Now we need to make a turn, and I haven't lost that tone yet, so that's not nice. I don't want that tone. Whoa, 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 close. Okay, right about here. Yeah, and there's a red dot up ahead. Oh, that doesn't sound very good. Just keep low. And hopefully nothing is going to hit me. Uh, it's one of those moments where you're gripping the stick so goddamn hard, you know? You let go for a second, your hand gets circulation back. This is a tense one. I like this. Uh-oh. That thing's awfully... Oh, shit! It's right in front of me! Oh, fuck! It was a flanker. Well, that's the furthest I've made it, guys. That was a good run, man. Has anybody completed this one? I'm sure some of you guys are really good at this kind of shit, and you have, but... Yeah, there was a flanker behind me. I wasn't paying attention. I was just going so low and so fast trying to get the hell out of there. And uh, I didn't want to engage anything because then I would really, you know, show myself to the air defenses. So that was pretty cool, though. Definitely very tense, man. One of the cooler missions, for sure. And, um, again, this is the one that comes with the Normandy map. So, not quite sure how I'm supposed to complete this one, but it was really fun trying. Definitely super fun. And again, uh, if you have the Normandy map, and I swear I tried running this mission before, and since I didn't have the World War II assets pack, it didn't even let me have it. I think this one requires the World War II assets pack too. I don't know why, but it does, I think. So, that's that, guys. This is the low altitude reconnaissance mission from the Normandy map for the F-18 Hornet. As always, please subscribe to the channel. 
Thanks for watching. Feel free to hit that like button. And until next time.